Morning all, this is Jag, your Office 365 daily vlogger. I'm at the um, airport waiting for uh, one of my colleagues to join me. I'll be heading off to Adelaide just to catch up with a client to plan out the, um, their Office 365 rollout. Anyway, I'll uh, see you in Adelaide when I get there. Cheers. Uh, I've just landed in Adelaide it's nice and toasty so it's actually 42 degrees can you believe um, and it's gonna be a very hot day anyway so this week let's kick off uh, our discussion around Microsoft stream so the Microsoft stream for those of you who actually haven't checked out yet uh, it's it's a secure video service so that's where you actually can host your all your business video content uh, I've, I've I've seen a lot of clients use you know um, less secure means to to store their video content. You know they they would store it on a on a cloud storage, do like a Dropbox or, or Google Drive for sharing with other people, or even worse, they actually use YouTube um, unlisted or YouTube private. Uh, you know why use a, a third party service when you actually have a, a, a secure enterprise grade um, video hosting service built in as part of your Office 365 uh, tenancy. So Office, um, so if you haven't actually checked out Microsoft Stream, I would encourage you to check out Microsoft Stream. So when you think Microsoft Stream, it, th there's two main use cases. One is to host your video content. You know, the video content could be uh, any, any video content, you know, the training content or uh, a, you know, executive messages and whatnot. Any, anything that's in the video format can, can be uh, hosted on, on Microsoft Stream. Um, we'll talk about, you know, um, you know, low level details around, you know, uh, how, how you know how you could actually use Microsoft Stream secure service, uh, like you know, to, to get some of the business problems sorted out. Um, one use case, the main use case, is a secure secure uh, video hosting. The next is uh, it, with the recent update, Microsoft is actually supporting live um, streams on on Microsoft Stream, so you could actually conduct town hall style uh, live events. And host them on Microsoft Stream as well. These are the two main uh, use cases of Microsoft Stream. So in the later videos, we'll talk about each of these two use cases in in, in greater detail. Stay tuned for those videos. And if you haven't connected with me on LinkedIn yet, please do. Um, I, I post regular videos about talking about various Office 365 topics. Thank you, and I will uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Cheers. Bye.